I've always been a very creative person and I wanted to take on a career where I could express my creativity and I sort of went to interior design school on a whim but from the first day of design school I just felt like I was in the right place. I think maybe this needs to move back and it's only gotten better from there. One of the most challenging things about being an interior designer is the execution part of things. There's a lot of moving parts to every project and just executing things seamlessly can sometimes be a bit of a challenge. What do you guys think? Yeah, that looks much better. Sourcing is definitely one of the most enjoyable and fun parts of the process. Are we thinking gray or white for the shags? It's amazing to sit with people and hear what they want to achieve and try to interpret that and then bring that to life. So that's definitely one of my favorite parts of the design process. I was really excited when House and Home asked me to create a space at LT and when they told me I could choose whatever room I wanted to, I thought about what, what was the least likely room for me to have the opportunity to design in. I just thought a cocktail room would be so much fun and would allow us to be creative with the pieces and the lighting that we chose. We really just wanted to go with something warm and monochromatic. We really wanted to create some focal areas from lighting and artwork and that's what we did here. When Lydia, Chantal and I first came to LT, we came upstairs and saw the space that we had to work with and it was really a blank canvas, unpainted, and we sat down and figured out a paint color and then we drew up a floor plan and then we walked through the store and chose all the pieces that we thought would work best. We should get a dog up there, it'd be so fun. Yeah, maybe that black yeah. one we saw before. Love that. It was amazing working with no budget. It just really allowed us to be so creative. We can yeah, we can do like a this. cluster of balls, maybe those balls in the lighting section do three clusters of them. But it was just so much fun running around and sourcing all the furniture and accessories. One of my favorite things that we did in the space was how we paired the horse photography with the three mirrors going vertically on the wall. I just think it really gives the room that sense of luxury and lusciousness. And I just also love the chartreuse ottoman. I could picture myself sitting on the black chair with my feet up and having a glass of wine. And another thing that I loved are the gold balls that we just placed on the floor. I just think it creates an awesome focal area and just gives the room that punch that it needs. When I think about a cocktail room, I envision men getting together and socializing and drinking whiskey and scotch so that's where the inspiration came from for the design of this room. I think I gravitate to a design style that's modern but at the same time timeless with a little bit of edge. The room is not complete without a dog in it. <laughs> this is true. <laughs> oh gosh, it's heavy. I really try to layer different textures and introduce new materials and we're just always looking to do new things and push the design envelope. My favorite color. I don't love color. I don't mind introducing it in very small ways, but I don't like color. I think I'm drawn to more tone on tone things. Better? And then I like to introduce color in very small ways. For example, in this room, we use the chartreuse ottoman just to introduce a pop of color or an artwork. But I think if you want to create a timeless look, then tone on tone is always a good way to go. When you're working with a client, it's definitely more of a collaboration. You're really trying to get a sense of their lifestyle and what they're trying to achieve, and then you're trying to bring that to life. Whereas when you're doing a space like this for House and Home at LT, and you have free reign, you can just be as creative as you want, and it's definitely a lot of fun. So it was just a great day. Lydia and Chantal and myself all just love doing this room, and overall, it was just such a great day. What do you think? I would have cocktails here. For sure. Serve it up. <laughs> <laughs>